hello students how are you all i hope all of you are fine and uh, welcome back to your next english class this is your nupur ma'am speaking here and uh, <clears throat> i hope uh, you are enjoying your class and uh, means your lesson and all it is uh, which yeah so what was going on just uh, you remember about determiners the last in the previous day i have discussed about determiners and i have discussed uh, what is determiner how uh, you can use it and how many kinds of determiners are there so there are so many kinds of determiners okay and you know all i have given all the examples so today uh, and uh, i told you that um, when you use uh, like this all so there are so many like uh, first of all you have to know the correct use of determiners you have to know those right how where you can use a, a little where you can use a little where you can use a few where you can use a few so you have to know the uses so for that is why i have made one practice work see but before that i am telling you just a little bit about the some um, determiners okay just like uh, which you can see yeah so <clears throat> suppose there is little please uh, listen very carefully suppose this is a uh, little little is a negative adjective and means uh, not much means hardly any okay little is negative adjective it means it it gives a negative sense it means a not much little means a not much means hardly any if you find if you will go to find so hardly you will uh, check uh, any okay suppose i am telling he has little common sense here little means not much means hardly some okay suppose i am saying there is little hope of the recovery so you can understand if i am writing there is little hope of her recovery so you can understand there is a not much means uh, just a little hardly one hardly any right suppose i am telling a little when you are telling a little it is affirmative adjective it is a differentiate between uh, two determiners it is a affirmative adjective suppose is affirmative means means some at least certain quantity a very very poor quantity but some at least okay suppose i am telling he spent only a little means a little money on himself okay so here a little means some at least at least some okay and so this is a differentiate between a little a little you can see there i have given little a little i have given you today little a little few a few some any less fewer oldest eldest see the options uh, oldest eldest uh, few a few uh, much many and uh, some or any okay so i am giving you a little bit a uh, little bit just uh, expression so i have told you a uh, little a little now few a few 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 a few these are the adjective of number okay few is a negative adjective and it means uh, not many few few is a negative negative adjective okay and it means uh, not many few these are these few and a few these are adjective of number okay this is this was a quantity but this is number 
and a few there is a little bit difference between few is a negative adjective and a few is affirmative whenever you are telling a few it is affirmative adjective okay and it means some at least okay suppose i am telling few persons or suppose i am telling a few people see few people in india are rich few people in india are rich so you can understand if you will, if you will go to find a few people you will get not many few means a not many it's a negative adjective it means not many but whenever you are telling a few suppose you are telling uh, i have still a few rupees left i am writing here i have still a few sorry uh where i will write here rupees left sorry left right so you can understand here a few means some at least some at least if, if you will go to count you will get some at least okay so this is the difference between few and a few so and uh, there are so many less fewer some any and uh, some any okay so the use of some or any first some you it is also quantifiers i hope you you can understand quantifiers right what is the quantifiers you you can understand that um, whenever you, you can count number you can uh, countable and countable just like that some any this are uh, some and any okay suppose you are telling this some or any so this um, affirmative sentence in affirmative sentence use of adjective some and in negative sentence use any some is a affirmative sense any is a negative sense right means in affirmative sentence you can use some in negative sentence you can use any and in interrogative sentence we say usually is any uh, usually uh, use a gen any any right usually um, uh, we generally you can see whenever you uh, used to write interrogative sentence you will write any you will use any okay suppose i am telling there is um, some money in my purse there is some money in my purse okay so you can understand not any some but suppose you are telling that uh, i have not any money to spare so you can understand it's a negative sense not some not some right so this is a differentiate between some and any and uh, less fewer oldest eldest oldest eldest you know very well oldest eldest you you know the uh, uses oldest denotes the greatest age right and eldest eldest um, denotes eldest means a first born right okay eldest means the first born superlatively and oldest oldest means uh, you can understand oldest uh, denotes the greatest age so these are and uh, so and less and fewer less refers only to quantity less refers only to quantity suppose i am telling we do not sell less than 5 kilos of sugar we 
do not sell i am not writing here because it is a long sentence we do not sell less than 5 kilos of sugar so you can count here and suppose you are telling then fewer fewer only two number less quantity less refers only to quantity whenever you can uh, count the quantity and less uh, sorry fewer is refers uh, to number no fewer than 40 soldiers were killed in the explosion i hope you can understand the differentiate between two uh, words right so next i'm going to the practice work today i am giving you only on these nine sentences no not this because uh, there are so many example uses of so i will discuss uh, on the next video see fill in the blanks with one or two words given in the brackets he is a fool and has dash little a, a little sense they are still dash flowers in the garden few or a few now you know the uses of this all you have to do it i have not had that dinner today some or any there are no dash in than 10 persons are uh, concerned less or fewer i have not had dash letters from the since uh, from her since she left some or any he is the dash man in the village oldest or eldest his dash son is an engineer oldest or eldest he does not sell less than five pounds of tea less or fewer now you have to understand when uh, the noun is countable or uncountable you can count or not okay and dash person can keep a secret fewer of you so these are your practice work today this nine sentences uh, please you can pause your video and you can write in uh, please i am telling you that write in your copy and just uh, do it okay if you uh, have any problem definitely you can ask me okay so please do it and uh, wait for the next video have a nice day thank you so much bye bye